Hi, yeah, you all right? I'm just sat here having a brew and I'm thinking, I've had a shower, I've washed my hair, I'm thinking maybe you will take us out for my dinner today. And then Amelia pipes up, will you make some pancakes? So now Ian wants pancakes. So now I'm making pancakes for everyone and I'm not going out for my dinner. Raging. I'm more raging now because there's no milk. So I'm having to go to the shops on a Saturday just to get milk. I'm back. I've got milk. Right, these couldn't be simpler, which is just as well because I can't be bothered for anything more than simple. So you need self-raising flour. Get yourself a teacup. Not a mug, unless you want to make loads. A teacup. Fill the teacup with flour. Self-raising flour. Get a bowl. That's filled up. Into there. The same amount of milk. There we go. And then one egg. Just as well, because that's all there is. Oh god, and I've got shell in it. Hang on. This is what happens when you cook and you're not in a good mood. You just ruin it. One egg. I like to put some vanilla essence in there. I also sometimes like a bit of um, orange flavouring. That's sometimes nice, but half a teaspoon vanilla essence or extract, if you've got it. If you don't, it doesn't matter. Find a whisk in this cupboard. Whiskey mixture up. There we go, we've got a fairly loose batter. The odd lump doesn't matter. I've got a little bit of sunflower oil in the pan, just warming it through. And I'm gonna make a decent sized one. Leave it alone. Just let it blip, it'll tell you when it's ready. See these little bubbles? That's the pancake saying it's ready to be turned over once all these bubbles come up. Let's have a little look. There we go. Just flip it over. This one's going to be caramel and banana. Hence the banana. Just going to chop it in. Keep a little bit back for the top. Make it look nice. I've got some salted caramel ice cream sauce. Pop some of that in. I'm going to turn this one over. I've got some squirty cream. Stick some banana in it. And another drizzle. Who wouldn't want that? Now this one's Ian's, so I'll go and give this to him. Gorgeous. He's just said it doesn't want it. So I'll have to have it. I'm not a fan of pancakes, but it's nice. I used to make these all the time for the kids when they were little. All the time, they loved them. So, if you want to make some nice pancakes for a husband who appreciates them, give these a go. Gorgeous. That mixture will make a few. Depends how big you make them if they make. If you make just the little ones, I would say you'll get about eight. If you make these big ones, you probably get four. Mm. Nice. I'm gonna sit and have this. There's no more cooking getting done in this house today. I'm putting my foot down. 
whatever you're doing, have a great day. Enjoy whatever it is you make for your tea and I'll see you soon. Don't forget to like and share. Bye bye.